the Oromo youth and community were the first to oppose and rebel against the centralizing tendencies and initial policies of the Abbey government. Although Abbey came to power as a result of the sort of rebellion of the Oromo youth called the Cairo movement, right? Um, between 2014 and 18. But of course, that was not very organized and organized savvy political groups, as I mentioned earlier, were able to capture, sort of really put their money on Abbey. Uh, everyone who was singing Kumbaya, uh, you know, believing that Abbey is going to be the Messiah, who is going to bring peace and stability and even prosperity to Ethiopia, uh, including the international community that ended up uh, awarding him a Nobel uh, Peace Prize, uh, this group, the Oromo Liberation Army, refused to heed the call to lay down its arms. The commanders of uh, this, this army were very suspicious of the moves Abi undertook from the get-go. It probably had information. I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know that he was fixed, basically. 